have struggled for quite a few years, most of my teenage years, to kind of find who am I really and like what things do I actually like, you know, who am I at my core. And looking back on the experiences that I've had, a lot of the things that I've done have been for other people or for appearances. And it's kind of like a tough pill to swallow because it's like, well, have I been living my whole life for other people, for other circumstances? Like even with these videos, you know, with these challenges that I've tried to do, like painting, like playing piano, doing music, doing the juggling and the football. I'm not sure if even I really wanted to do that or if I just wanted to be good or show the progress of having that so then other people would like me and so that I would get more views. And that kind of sucks because I have this whole, I have all these videos that I've recorded and uploaded and some of them even have quite a bit of views. Well, compared to my other ones, you know, in the 20s, I think the juggling one has. And so they're doing better than the other ones, but I don't think that's who I really am. And that's me trying to put on this act, this facade, this mask, you know, to, it's kind of saying like, oh, if I get good at juggling, then people will like me because I'll be good at this skill. And it's like this condition, you know, like I have to have, a, it's like I'm putting a condition on myself to be happy to do these videos and when I was little when I wanted to start a YouTube channel I think it was first when I was 12 or 13 I just did it because I kind of thought it'd be fun it looked fun people that were in the videos looked like they were having fun and then I kind of got really embarrassed and anxious because other people saw it and I was like oh what are they going to think of me and then I thought well I just got to kind of fit in go along and when you just do that, there's kind of like this, I don't know, like this, just like this buzz kind of underlying kind of ambience. I can't find the word quite for what I'm trying to say, but it's just like flat, flat, you know, it's like there's no depth or excitement to it because it's not connecting to what I value and what I truly want and what I'm trying to experience. So that's why I've done this video. <laughs> it's kind of frustrating because I have the next week's videos up, um, kind of recorded already, but I might take some of them down because I feel like I wasn't really being authentically me and I'm, I'm trying to cut through all this kind of fog and just find out like what is it that I actually want and enjoy because all of these things that I'm doing just feels like a facade at the moment. I guess that's what I'm just trying to say that I'm trying to find authenticity deeper in myself without having conditions or needs to be met by through other people, through external things and trying to listen more to my internal kind of needs and wants. Anyway, that was a different video, so thank you for watching if you did. I'm not sure how this is going to go moving forward, but I'll just see how it goes, I guess. Kind of share, document. <laughs>